Hey Aquarius, I'm Divinely Destined. How are you? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. I'm going to give you a daily message, Aquarius. Remember though, it's a general message. My love, it may or may not resonate with you. Always take a reading how it resonates. Never try to make it fit. You don't know if it's for you. I love you. I thank all my day one subscribers and all the newbies for supporting me and hanging in there with me through the ups and downs of having this channel. I do this out of love, okay? This is my job, but I also do it out of love. This is something I love to do. I pray that you guys get the opportunity and um, that, you know, I pray that you guys get the opportunity to also do what you love to do. Okay, Aquarius? Happy holidays. I love you. Aquarius, I feel like there's some... So, ooh. Yeah, you're nervous, Aquarius? <laughs> there's some communication you want to have with someone. I feel like you're getting ready to reach out to someone that you haven't spoken to in a long time, Aquarius. I feel like you've always wanted, you've always had a lot of love for this person, but for whatever reason, it didn't quite work out. So you wasn't able to communicate with this person, you know, the way you wanted to, but I feel like you're getting ready to call this person, text this person. And by the way, Aquarius, yes, this person needs you here. Okay, we got the Four of Cups. Overall energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy with the Four of Cups. Yeah, you may have been blind to the fact that, or you may have been absolutely refusing to accept the fact that you had a true love. You have a true love in your life, Aquarius. This may be a Leo. Yes, <laughs> the sun shines on this connection that you have with this individual. For whatever reasons, I mean, you may have been married. You may be married. You may be, you may have been in a long-term commitment already when you met this person. And you were not, you was not able to proceed forward with the connection. And I feel like God is saying, okay, are you ready now? <laughs> Do you feel like you're ready to proceed forward with this connection? Okay. Are you ready to be honest, open, and available for true love? Okay. Because it's there. It's for you. Okay. We got the king of swords, Aquarius energy, Libra energy, Gemini energy. Yeah. You're watching someone, but I feel like this is spirit watching you. Spirit has watched, spirit has watched you time and time and time again, refuse to take this opportunity here. I mean, what are you scared of? Okay. Spirit is saying, what are you scared of, Aquarius? This is someone that they that spirit has for you. This person is not going to hurt you. This person is actually your equal here. Spirit is watching you. Spirit, ha spirit has watched you decline this offer or not take this opportunity for a long time. If this is not love, this may be some sort of career opportunity. Okay, spirit is nudging you to start taking steps toward making your dreams your reality. If this is a love situation, yeah, you're being called out on why you've been dragging your ass on a connection that is meant for you. Okay, only you know why. Okay, but spirit is certainly watching you here. Spirit says you've been cold, you've been detached, you've been emotionally unavailable to this individual, but this is someone that, you know, they have for you. Okay, this is someone that is for you, Aquarius. Okay, yes, three of, pen three of pentacles. This may be a business relationship. This may also be a love connection. Once again, this may be someone that you're destined to be in a partnership with, Aquarius. And, you know, <laughs> sometimes... You just block your blessing, okay? You blocking your blessing. This person could bring more abundance to your life because I feel like you're already um, very abundant by yourself. But with this person by your side, you guys could go to heights and levels that you have no idea, okay? Because it's a blessed union, okay? We got justice, Libra. And you may be dealing with a Libra here. Libra energy. We got Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and we have Leo on the board. We also have Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Yes, yeah, Spirit says you need to justify this situation. You need to make this right, Aquarius. Or Spirit is looking at someone like, why have you been not accepting the fact that I have an Aquarius for you? This is your. This is the person that I have called to be your husband. This is the person I have called to be your wife, okay? For years, months, decades, you have been denying this connection. You have been denying yourself. When you deny yourself of this connection, you, des you deny yourself, okay? So Spirit is checking this person, Aquarius. And if this is you, Aquarius, spirit is checking you, okay? It's time to get right with this person because your blessings will flow more abundantly when you're, in, when you're in alignment with, when you're in alignment with what you're supposed to be doing and who you're supposed to be with Aquarius, things flow better for you. Spirit is also able to get you your blessings quicker too, okay? Yeah, you're out of alignment with what's supposed to be yours here, Aquarius, okay? Yes, I feel like you're manifesting a new opportunity with this Virgo or this Gemini here, okay? Yes. <laughs> yeah, you had to deal with what you had to deal with. You may have already been in a connection when you met this when you met this in, uh, individual. Okay, you may have only wanted sex from this person, okay? But spirit is saying that they have more this is more than a sex-based relationship. This is a spiritual connection that is ordained here, okay? 
This is not all about sex. And you may have just wanted it to keep it on a passionate level, but this is actually going deeper. This is actually a deeper connection that spirit has for you. And I see that you may be manifesting. Spirit is trying to help you here, Aquarius. Okay, spirit is like, we're nudging you here. Okay, it's time to wake up to the fact that this is your destiny here. If this is not about love, this is about a business. This is about um, financial increase here. You may have been wanting to stay with the job that you're comfortable with. You may not make as much, but you're comfortable there and you've been there 20 years. You may be someone that's very stuck in their ways and that you may not like change. Spirit may be nudging you and I think spirit is nudging you to see that you have the potential to own your own business and you have the potential to make millions, Aquarius, but you got to get out of your own way. I feel like you're in your own way here. You're holding yourself back here. You're blocking your own blessings from coming to you, okay? Yes, we got the eight of wands. Yes, I feel like spirit is saying, okay, we're gonna give you, um, we're gonna give you another opportunity to make this right with this situation, okay? Once again, if this is love, spirit is saying we're gonna give you another opportunity to reach out to this person. We're gonna give you another opportunity. We're gonna rearrange this thing again for you, Aquarius, to be in your favor, to make it right with this person. Yes, <laughs> I think spirit is gonna work something out where you guys are gonna either run into each other or you're gonna end up calling this person. Okay, there's gonna be some kind of. I'm hearing a serendipity. Okay. Spirit is working this thing out for you, Aquarius. They're going to give you an opportunity to, to see this person, call this person, be in communication with this person again. But you must know with the Queen of Swords, this person, oh, we got the Queen and, and the King of Swords. So you may have you may have been unable to be with your the person that you really love due to the fact that you were in a marriage here. But with the King and the Queen of Swords, I feel like you are divorced. I'm talking to an Aquarius that has just recently went through a divorce or is undergoing a divorce process, especially with justice here. So you couldn't be, you, okay, you have legal reasons, okay? You were already in a legal situation with someone, Aquarius, and you couldn't be with the one that you really loved here, I'm seeing, okay? Spirit is saying now, okay, you got that out of the way. Okay, now it's time to focus on the future here. Okay, yes. Spirit says, we know it hurts. Divorce is never easy. Separations of the heart, okay? Having to leave someone that you really love or someone that really loved you, leaving you hurts, Okay. But that person was a karmic cycle that you had to go through. That wasn't your true love here, okay? Yep, you walked away from someone that ultimately was not really for you anyway, Aquarius, okay? You have someone that is already destined. You already have a destined love connection in your life. You may not know it, but you do. You may also, yeah, most certainly, Aquarius, you have someone that you're destined to be with, okay? Yes, with the king and the queen of swords, most certainly you, you are divorced. You have underwent a divorce recently. You may be going through a divorce as we speak. We got the Queen of Wands, Sagittarius energy. You may be leaving the Sagittarius behind, okay? You may have walked away from a relationship with the Sagittarius, okay? That wasn't your destiny. Yeah, Spirit is looking at you, Aquarius. Spirit is also helping you manifest new opportunities, okay? New opportunities are ahead, okay? We have positive movement forward, okay? Yes, that boat is going forward with or without you, Aquarius, okay? You don't want to continue to miss out on opportunities that are for you, okay? Yeah, you may be someone that is very set in their ways. You may not like change, but change, you know, inevitably it's better to go with the flow of things in life, okay? It's better to go with the flow of the current than against it, okay? We got triumph and success. I feel like there's going to be some communication here. This relationship that you're destined to be in is going to happen, okay? I'm hearing, yeah, Spirit is saying we're working this out for you, Aquarius. We got transformation. You may be undergoing some transformation, and especially if you're going through a divorce, of course you're undergoing some transformations in your life right now, okay? But also, just on a spiritual level, you may be undergoing some transformations. But you can rejoice. You, you can rejoice, Aquarius, because you, you, you have a very bright future ahead of you. Amazing opportunities are right in front of you, Aquarius, okay? Yeah, you may want to propose to someone here. I feel like you're going to propose to the love of your life. Yeah, eventually I feel like you are. You may be penny pinching right now. You may be saving money. Yeah, it's good to save as well. Yep. Spirit is saying, don't miss out on the greatest love of your life, okay? Yes, don't keep ignoring the signs that we have someone for you, Spirit says. Don't keep ignoring it. You have been ignoring the signs for years. Yep, you have to leave. You left. You left a relationship that was no longer serving you, okay? It was holding you back from your destiny, I'm hearing. Yes, I see that someone wants to make up Aquarius. Now, this may be you, but I feel like you're going towards that person. I told you in the beginning of the reading that you're destined to be with here. You're going towards this person. Okay, eventually you got, you guys, I'm hearing collision course here. We have stuck in your ego. You may be scared. You may feel like this person is not going to take your phone calls or this person doesn't want to hear anything from you. 
I feel like this person is waiting to hear from you. Don't let negative fear, don't let your own negative thinking and fear stop you. Okay, Aquarius? <laughs> yes. I see that you have an obsession with someone here, Aquarius. I feel like this is your true love. You've been, a, you've been obsessed with this person for a long time, or they've been obsessed with you. Okay. You were married. You were, you were in a commitment. You were unable to give this person the, the love that they deserve. Spirit says you're free now. Okay. You're free to make this person your wife. Okay. You're free to make that person your husband. It's okay to go ahead and reach out and communicate because now is the time. I love you. God bless.